Cheers. So listen, um, when I when I get this ring, mm. is there a budget? <laughs> well, it's the promise of my eternal love. You see, you can't put a price on that. Well, that depends on how long you live. Oh, cheers. Nice thought. Mm -hmm. What the hell? If you didn't want me to see it, you should have hidden it better. Roxy. And you're supposed to be babysitting. I've dropped them with Sharon. It's from Dean. Yeah, well done, the ex cop. Well done. What the hell is he writing to you for? No, do you know what? I don't want to know. All right, why can't you just stay out of anything? So I take it ring binds on old. All right, my police officer, she said I can give evidence from behind a screen. Yes, but I was trying to get you to avoid all of that, all right? So I asked Dean to change his plea to guilty. Hang on a minute. Hang on a minute. Last week, last week you were convinced it was going to be put away. He's going to go down. That's what you said. He Ron. will. But you wrote to him. So what? What does that mean? I'm going to mess it up, am I? No, of course not. You know, I'm probably going to be the first witness. And two, mi two minutes ago, I was ready. I thought, yeah, it's going to be tough. It's going to be tough. But you know what? At least I'll get to see the back of him. And now, what are you saying to him? You're saying that's not going to happen. I'm going to call Sharon and ask her to have the kids a bit longer. Oh, yeah, she'll love that. Come on, Emily. Come on. I was only thinking about you. Well, I know I went about it in the wrong way, but you have to remember, I was there before in court. I mean, all right, it was completely different circumstances. You don't have to bring this up, Ron. Yeah, but I do, for your sake. I wouldn't wish this on anyone. It's terrifying. I'll cope, somehow. Well, at least let me and Jack try to explain what's going to happen, because the defence, they're going to come at you, and it's not going to be pretty. I'll, um, I'll tell them to keep it down. She testifying tomorrow. Last up I heard. I want to buy him a drink. Let's get it from both of us. I'll be behind the screen. Yeah, but the trouble is you won't feel like it. <sighs> I think I was better off being blissfully ignorant. Trust me, you weren't. Here. Cheers. From both of us. Rocks. Yours is a double. Look, I've been in loads of calls, so I can tell you what'll happen. Then you'll be prepared, and who knows? Maybe you'll surprise him. You know, not the defence or killer. It feels like I'm climbing into a boxing ring. Well, you are. Ron, I can see why you wrote to him, OK? Anything that helps put him away, Rox, that's the bottom line. Dean is not walking free. Safety issue, you know. I'm so sorry. I I'll get you a full refund and and a, a free drink. Mm. 